Hi students, in this video again I am going to talk to 6th standard students. So we have been talking about what do animals eat and their food habits and different senses used by them and different body parts used by them in collecting their food and various sub concepts related to how do animals eat their food we have been talking. Okay. In the last video we have talked about how does a frog get its food and how does a cow get its food okay students and uh, i asked you to answer some of the questions i gave few questions related to the information that i explained in the last class and here in this video other animal like dog cat tiger and all and uh, the food habit of these animals and the body parts how they are developed in them how they are developed in them that we are the things and all we are going to talk in this video students and before that uh, I wanted to uh, ask you one thing that the frog what is the food of a frog based on the food habits under which group of the animals whether the frog comes under herbivore, carnivore or omnivore. Frog comes under, obviously we can say, uh, as its food habit is to eat insects and all, this comes under carnivores. Okay, and at the same time, uh, what is the food habit of cow, buffalo, goat, sheep, etc.? These animals eat only grass, so that we can classify this kind of animals as herbivores because they eat parts of plant okay like that we have to understand and also I asked you to compare the animals food habits and body parts involved in collecting food and finding food that you have to write in your notebook okay and in this video I'm going to talk about what how does dog get its food what how does dog get its food a dog gets its food yeah we have been talking about dog okay see here one thing did you ever see a dog chasing a cat yes most of you might have seen dogs chasing cats and even did you ever see cats chasing rats yes you might have seen the cats chasing rats you know chasing in the sense what what hunting okay some animals hunt and get their food hunt and get their food you know make a list of the animals which hunt and get their food here we are talking about only dog right so this comes under hunting group and what else cat lion tiger etc these are the animals they hunt and get their food here as far as the body parts of these animals are concerned the body parts like limbs four limbs that means legs front legs and hind limbs the back legs of the animals are well developed their muscles are very strong they help them to run fast behind the other animal to catch it to chase it yes and not only the limbs of these animals and the what are and what are the other parts well developed in finding or getting their food in collecting their food yeah its mouth their mouth is also well developed and what are the parts of the mouth well developed and what are the parts of the limbs yeah 
parts of the limbs like you know claws claws like this you know the tiger feet if you observe tiger feet uh, very strong and sharp claws and they help the tiger to run hold the ground firmly and then uh, to run fast and fast okay and uh, in, uh, as far as this mouth is concerned and other parts related to the mouth what are the other parts related to mouth the parts of the mouth like teeth and tongue okay and also upper and lower jaws see here the jaws are also well developed in tiger dog lion etc and they play a major role in holding the other animal in between the two jaws and tearing the flesh of the other animal and other part of the mouth you know teeth other part of the mouth you know the teeth present on upper and lower jaw also very sharp and strong they are very sharp they catch the animals and and also here sharp claws and sharp teeth help the animals these animals like dog and cat and lion and tiger help them to tear the flesh okay and like this the animals get their food okay students and the questions related to this and you just compare the differences between dog and cat and lion and tiger and etc that you have to find the differences and write in your notebook students what are the differences between um, dog and cat a question for you how does how do cat and dog use their use their teeth okay you just write answer to this question and present in our whatsapp group okay and before that uh, before concluding this video and uh, let me tell you one thing you might have seen a, the cat or dog putting complete concentration on its food you know before catching the food it puts its concentration and you know complete concentration on the food on the other animal which is going to be caught by this cat or dog so how rapidly it jumps over the other animal you know yes its concentration he is very high in collecting its food okay whose concentration these animals concentration what hunting animals like especially hunting animals con concentration levels are very high in collecting their food or getting their food okay this is how the animals get their food next and one more question to you students uh, let us find some information about the animals using their tongue uh, name of the animal you have to write here and do they otherwise uh, use of tongue use of tongue see the name of the animal like frog cow 
and dog in which animal or in which living thing in which living thing the tongue is well developed here yes well developed tongue okay this column is about only tongue tongue is very developed and well developed in frog comparing to not developed well not well developed comparing to frog and even uh moderately developed okay uh sometimes you might have seen dog licking it's partly developed comparing to frog i'm taking uh, uh i'm uh, comparing to frog i'm telling you students okay partly partly developed okay comparing to frog here like this you can understand how the animals tongues are developed okay yeah and also uh, let me give you uh, some information about some information about what getting food without with out you should not write separate without without hunting okay getting food without hunting can you give some examples to the statement which animals get their food without hunting you know just before i taught about some of the animals get their food with hunting here you have to give some examples examples of the animals which get their food without hunting okay and what you have to write here is here you have to write at least write at least two examples for getting food without animal for the animals getting food without hunting can you give do it as a homework okay some of the animals get their food without hunting right now one more important and interesting thing that one of the videos i talked about birds beaks and their shapes okay beaks of different birds and their shapes and did you ever see the birds have did you ever see the birds consisting teeth in its mouth in its beaks no right but i say yes some of the birds beaks consist of teeth in them example it's very interesting that what question first let me ask you the question do the birds have teeth do the birds have teeth 
आई से यस एग्जाम्पल डक इफ यू सी द बीक ऑफ डक हिया not this much of students like this like this you can understand the beaks of duck consist of teeth okay so this uh, curves you know this bends are nothing but what teeth but do they do the teeth help in chewing do the teeth of duck help in chewing no they don't help in chewing but what is the use of the teeth of a duck teeth of duck help in filtering you know the food uh, collecting ducks collecting food in mud water right ducks collecting you might have seen the ducks collecting food in mud water so in the process of collecting food it dips into the mud water and sucks the water in it into its mouth sucks water into its mouth in the process what happens the teeth present on its beak help in filtering okay help in filtering the the teeth present on the beak help in filtering this is how the ducks get their food not only duck not only ducks and some fish also some fish also have teeth in its mouth you know teeth in its mouth so this uh, the teeth in fish also help in filtration okay for the same purpose and what you have to do is you have to write the information about this you know how do uh, do the birds have teeth how do dogs or what are the hunting animals and what are the uh, with animals get food without hunting how does a dog get its food and all in, the, in this video we have talked all of these things and you have to write about all these things in your notes and present in our whatsapp group students thank you thank you for listening thank you one and all